Okay, so we are dropping around bail today and I have been challenged, well, not I, everybody in the equestrian YouTube community has been challenged, which I think is awesome, by the way. Um, the amount of people that are participating and all of the new videos that pop up in my inbox to be able to watch. You'll have to excuse me. I'm, I've been sick with the flu for the last four days. It's been awesome. This is the first day that I've felt some sort of normalcy. There's a challenge out that is, or a dare or whatever, to show your horse's personality. So that's what I'm trying to do today is get a few clips of little Miss Flirty Pants because she is probably one of the most personality-filled horses I've had. Uh, every horse does have a lot of personality, I get that, and I certainly, you know, they, they're all very individual, but man, she's like a puppy dog, like a puppy dog. She follows you around everywhere, she kicks up her heels. This is Bubba. Bubba, say hi. Hi, Bubba, you're done, please don't lick me. I don't want you, no. Okay, good boy. He just got shaved last week. The The horse is seriously one of the most comical horses I've ever had. That's probably one of the best ways to put it. And I know there's others out there I honestly wish I had the joy of having and owning. But she's about six years old and I've had her since you could put one hand behind her butt and one hand in front of her chest and almost like scoop her up and throw her into a trailer. And um, I've just learned a lot how much more, you know, bond and personality you can have with a horse when you get to spend so much time with them. And so for all of you who get that opportunity uh, to live with your horses, it's really great. You should definitely um, be grateful for that. So I am about to get out and like I said, we're dropping around bail today. So I'm trying to do that and then I'll get some more clips of uh, Miss Little Flirty Pants and hopefully she'll be a fun little girl because it's quite windy today. So I bet some of her true colors will really show. Alrighty. So as we get ready to feed here, Soda will circle like a shark or go stand in his bucket and again flirt like a dog. She's going to stand right here next to me. There she is and wait for her food. Good girl, Flirty. I know. I know. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then there's the shark. You ready for your food? You want to go to your bucket? Where's your bucket? Yeah, it's over there. Okay, there's your food. Like any horse, she does love her food. Do you like your food? Yeah. I know. It's good food. She likes her food. Okay, so here we go. We already are acting like an absolute... Both of them are running around like cray cray. I fed them in hopes that I fed them enough to distract them long enough to get this done, but... I was literally just talking to y'all and then now I'm out of the truck and they are down here like little pigs. I'm going to take this opportunity to show you. There she is. She doesn't care about flapping tarps, that's for sure. See, this is one one reason. Oh, oh, oh. Wee! She really doesn't have a whole lot of fear. It gets her in trouble. She's pushy with fencing. If it's not a very good fence, she will simply lean her entire body weight into it and just push it down. There she goes. Flirty pants. She sees me, she's like, mm, she's going to chase me away from that round bale. Let's see what we can get. Don't hurt yourself. By the way, guys, 
big surprise. These horses will actually be on my own land again soon. Oh, she almost ran into a tree. Okay, side note, another thing about Flirt, she runs into trees. That's not the first time. She's done that several times. And I've got it on video, but it's embarrassing, so I usually don't show it. Oh, see, so just being a jerk. You're a jerk. You're mean. You're a mean pony. All right. So by the way, this is the first time that I have done any sort of FaceTime. Yeah, uh, I don't even know what to call it because I don't I don't do these kinds of videos. So I apologize if it's a little awkward. But it's kind of fun. And for those of you that haven't heard the news or don't know yet, I am pregnant. And hi flirt. She says, I still love you. Even though you're mean and you make me run around just for your own sake. Flirt. Okay, she's kinda mad at me. Are you kinda mad at me? Yeah, she's kinda mad at me. Okay, well, vlogging, that's what it's called. I believe. Um, I don't do the vlogging stuff. I personally have a very short attention span. So I just... Not my thing. But it's the first time. So it's the first time for everything. Did you get your run-ins in? Did you get your run-ins in? Huh? Thank you for giving me some beautiful footage. Yeah. So what was I saying? Okay, I was saying that I was pregnant, right? Oh, camera, okay. I'm pregnant, about 30 weeks. So I, I can't ride, it's killing me. But luckily I have friends who can come out and help me with the horses. I've got one coming today. Well, she's like a sister to me. Um, this is my trailer, and I am looking for a pair of scissors so I can cut down the nasty tarp that is blowing around, as you guys probably saw already. But yeah, I can't ride. It's killing me, guys. I, I, everybody's like, oh, your life is going to change. Yeah, I know that. I got that. Uh, it's already changed. <laughs> but... It's all for good. I'm very, very excited. I'm going to have a little boy. And if anybody, you know, they always ask, oh, is he going to be an equestrian? Is he going to be a rider? I say, well, I can guarantee he's going to get up on a horse. But I can't guarantee that he's going to be a rider. He's going to do whatever he wants. I'm not going to make him do anything. My only hope is that he does enjoy the horses. See, here she is again, like a dog. Hi, Flirt. She says, can you give me more food? I would like some more food, please. Like, oh, itch. The sun's coming out. Oh, thank God. It has been such crappy weather lately. Oh, Flirt. I can probably see why people like doing these vlog things. It just says that's a food. Give me the food, please. I want some food. And please excuse my messy trailer. Yeah, this is where I have to function out of because of the, because of everything. Um, and I was saying that my friend Kristen, who is more like a sister to me, uh, she helps me take care of the horses. I really don't know. I'm looking for scissors. I have no ideas. But yeah, I can see why people like doing this. It's kind of fun talking to yourself. It does make me feel a little insane, I will say. All right. I'm back to looking for scissors. See if Kristen's here. What? What? Flirt. Flirty. What? See how fun she is? See, Soda, he's like, mm, I don't really care what you're doing. But Flirt, Flirt's like, hi. What are you doing? That's my trash can. Please, hey, please don't eat, please don't eat my trash can. Yeah? Okay, thanks. She's not here yet. So, 
we're gonna continue looking for scissors, which I have no freaking clue what happened to them. I need some scissors. Oh, the trials and tribulations of daily life. Cannot keep up with anything. I really want my scissors. Are there any scissors? There ought to be scissors in the medical kit, but guess what? Probably not. That's Nope, no scissors. Oh my gosh, I swear. I don't know what I did with them. Toilet paper, that's always good to have. No scissors. Okay, Kristen, you can get here anytime now. We'll go back and check the trip, and there she is. Are you eating my food? You are, aren't you? Flirt. Get out of there. Soda would have just stood there and looked at me like, ha! You're gonna have to come and push me out of the way. So much fun to ride to. Seriously, one of the absolute most fun. Oh, well, there, she's back. You're back! She will always keep you company, I can guarantee you that. If you're ever lonely, just go out to the pasture and Flirt will come up to you. I really don't know what I do with those scissors. Okay, we're gonna have to stop this because I gotta find my scissors. What are you feeding her? <laughs> She's just trying to get your stuff? Yeah. Damn horses. <laughs> I want Dr. Pepper. I want some Dr. Pepper. I saw soda too. God, they're both on you like flies. Hi! Yeah, like, I know she has an apple core in there. Clark says, I like to be groomed. He just brushed you yesterday. Literally, almost. Was it yesterday? She says, I like to roll too. So you brush me more. <laughs> yeah. See, a nice cycle. She's got her lips going like crazy today for that. It all feels good. <laughs> That's right, scratch my belly. <laughs> Get my butt. Oh, God, the door was gonna hit me. I thought. Oh! Mess over there. Talking. I'm gonna get smacked by the door. <laughs> Brush my tail. <laughs> I like big butts and I cannot lie. <laughs> yeah, she has like the perfect dimple in her butt to hold things. <laughs> what is, why is he crying? Are you crying because you have to eat alone? Yeah, he's literally staring at me. Crying while he's over there. <laughs> oh. But the frog is so built up yeah. at the very back of it. That's okay, it's a shock pad. Yeah. It is. It's what makes her so bouncy. Oh. <laughs> leave them there then. <laughs> I like that. Spring over the fences. <laughs> I think, hey, dude, okay, space, space, go away, go, go. I just want to be on TV, Mom. God. Put me in your video. <laughs> you don't love me anymore. You never ride me. You don't give me cookies or Cheetos or Doritos. You don't even feed me anymore. Get out of my way. You're ruining my shot. That's ridiculous. <laughs> hey, it's the money shots that count. <laughs> I sure wish this window was down more. I could put my head in here and try to eat the seats. He's the one that put the hole in my console. From biting, trying to break your window. He was trying to bite it to get to the chicken. Chicken, huh? Yeah. I don't know, Kristen. There's something that looks really up about this. Did you do that? Like, did you really 
Does that look normal to you? The girth is really far back. Yeah, it does look like it's really far back. Maybe I shouldn't trust you with a new student. <laughs> yeah, you look good. I noticed it at least. <laughs> I would have noticed eventually. <laughs> You're like halfway asleep or something. Hey, get out of the trash. God. No cookies for you. <laughs> I think you're feeling better. <laughs> oh, I feel like I definitely have a like loopy head today. Man, I have literally been in a coma for four days. <laughs> the flu sucks. John's like, do you want anything? Uh, are you okay? Uh, how you feel? Uh. <laughs> it's, it's my response for everything. <laughs> 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 Only I didn't even have that much energy to make it sound so like powerful. It was like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I was pretty pathetic. <laughs> ha ha! The door's closed. He's <laughs> like, damn it. Can you open it? Can you open this thing? <laughs> Shut, Mom. <laughs> Someone shut the door. <laughs> I'm just gonna start walking. <laughs> Okie dokie. So my battery's about to die, and I'm sorry because I just I I got the flu. And I got cold, and I had to kind of like take a break, sit down, and also I was filming her, Kristen, that was Kristen, right? Uh, Little Miss Fr Flirty Pants. So, we're done for today, and I'm out, I'm leaving. Uh, got some good stuff. Hopefully I'll be able to use it, because I've never done anything like this, like I said. And I'm going to go home, take a hot shower, and eat something, and get feeling better. But the ponies are being taken care of by Kristen so that I can leave and not get sick again. That was fun. Hopefully we'll do it again. Bye guys. <laughs>